Hi, so here we have a problem which was sent by Mr. Dinesh Jangir and here we have to find the value of x. So this expression is made up of three terms and this term is negative and since on the right side we have zero, so just to make it easier I am going to shift this term to the right hand side. So this will become this much equal to this and now let us try to simplify the left hand side. So left hand side has x to the power 1 by 2 which can be written as square root of x plus x to the power minus 1 by 2 can be written as 1 divided by square root of x and then we have this division and in the denominator I have 1 minus x and similarly this can be written as 1 minus 1 divided by root x divided by 1 plus root x. So first I am going to simplify this term. So this can be written as if I simplify the numerator I will get 1 by root x common and inside the bracket I can write x plus 1 divided by 1 minus x and then we will have this plus sign and now we will solve the numerator over here. So we will get 1 divided by root x common and inside the bracket I will have root x minus 1 divided by root x plus 1. 1. Okay, so from these two terms I can take 1 divided by root x common and inside the bracket I'll have x plus 1 divided by 1 minus x and then we have plus and then we have root x minus 1 divided by root x plus 1. So to simplify this further let me multiply it by root x minus 1 divided by root x minus 1. This will not change the value of the expression. So this can be written as 1 divided by root x and here we have x plus 1 divided by 1 minus x. Then we have this plus sign. So the denominator over here will become x minus 1. Root x plus 1 multiplied by root x minus 1 will give you x minus 1 and numerator will be the square of root x minus 1. So that can be written as x plus 1 minus 2 root x. So here we have 1 minus x and here we have x minus 1. So if I take a minus sign common from here this will become a negative sign and both the denominators will be same. So this can be written as 1 divided by square root of x multiplied by 1 minus x this x plus 1 can be written as it is. So x plus 1 and here we will have a minus sign because I have taken minus sign common from here. So all the signs in the numerator will change. So I will get minus x minus 1 plus 2 root x and this was equal to 4 plus x divided by 1 minus x whole to the power 1 by 2 that is square root of this. Okay, so this x will cancel this minus x, this plus 1 will cancel this minus 1 and then this root x will cancel this root x and from here we will get 2 divided by 1 minus x is equal to square root of 4 plus x divided by 1 minus x and now let's square both the sides. So I'll get 4 divided by 1 minus x square is equal to 4 plus x divided by 1 minus x. So this 1 minus x will cancel 1, 1 minus x over here and from here we will get 4 is equal to 4 plus x multiplied by 1 minus x or this can be written as 4 is equal to if I multiply both the brackets I'll get 4 plus x minus 4x minus x square or you can say this 4 will cancel this 4 and from here we will get x square plus 3x which can be written as x multiplied by x plus 3. This is equal to 0 or you can say x is equal to 0 or x is equal to minus 3. So this is the solution for this problem. So we have got the value of x equal to 0 or minus 3. So that's all for this video. It was an interesting problem and if you also have an interesting problem and you want to share it with us you can send your problems to the number shown on the screen and for many more interesting videos keep watching MathSmart, subscribe to it and don't forget to press the notification bell because then only you'll get to know about my new upcoming videos. So bye bye till then.